Hi, this is a video to show you how to make a bar graph from your melting ice experiment. As we always do in science, we have the first column of our table. Here is the independent variable. In this case, it's different types of surface for the plates. Glass, paper, plastic and metal. And you can see here I've collected the data for the amount of ice that's melted into water that I've measured for the four different surfaces. So firstly, highlight the table, and then I'm gonna copy, just open up a new Google Sheet by typing in sheets.new, click on any rectangle, paste in, and you can see that it's already highlighted, so I'm gonna to go to insert chart, and it's made the bar chart for me. I'm going to click the three dots there, copy chart, go back to my original document and paste in. And I can see here from the results clearly that metal, uh, the, the ice cube on the metal plate has melted the most because it has the highest bar of over six millilitres of water. And the one that melted the least was the paper plate. So I can conclude that metal is a very good conductor of heat. Um, so it's actually conducting heat away from the ice cube, making it melt more quickly. And the paper is more of an insulator, so it keeps that coldness in uh, to uh, the ice cube, so it melts less.